Welcome to Motor Car Parts of America's Technical Installation Series. The purpose of this video is to address a starter issue due to a faulty crankshaft sensor. This issue applies to late model GM trucks or minivans that have experienced a no start or hard start condition. If you have experienced a kickback or backfire during startup or have a broken nose housing on your starter, and if you have an engine service light illuminated, DTC code P0338, you must replace the crankshaft position sensor before you replace the starter. Before we begin, make sure the battery is properly disconnected. Always disconnect the negative cable first. A memory saver can be used to keep the radio and other electrical components unchanged. Also, perform a voltage drop test to avoid other potential problems. And remember to wear proper safety gear and goggles. Once the battery has been disconnected, we can begin. First, start by removing the 13 mm mounting bolts that hold the starter in place. As you do this, do not let the starter hang from the starter harness. Next, remove the starter to identify damage. Damage may appear on the starter nose cone or on the flywheel. A damaged nose cone means the crankshaft sensor will have to be replaced. Next, locate the crankshaft position sensor, which on this vehicle is located above the starter and to the side of the engine block. Remove and replace the crankshaft sensor before installing the new starter. Once the crankshaft sensor is fastened and secured, reinstall the wire and battery cable to the new starter. Torque the mounting bolts according to the manufacturer's recommended torque specs. In this case, the OE calls for 39 foot-pounds of torque. The last step is to reinstall the battery. Attach the positive battery cable first and tighten the battery terminal. Repeat the same procedure for the negative cable. Remember, when installing the starter on GM vehicles with V6 and V8 engines from the late 90s to the mid-2000s, it's important to verify if the crankshaft sensor is at fault and to replace the faulty crankshaft sensor to ensure the newly replaced starter stays in proper working condition. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video. If you have questions, contact our Technical Support Center to talk to one of our ASE certified technicians. Our technicians are available seven days a week. In the United States, call 800-228-9672 and in Mexico, call 1-800-767-0210. Furthermore, if you have issues that may lead to returning a part, please call our Call Before You Return hotline at 888-933-9065, and our technicians will help troubleshoot the issues you may be having. Powered by MPA.